In this video, I'm going to show you how to create super cool and creepy effects using chroma key and text in Filmora 10. Keep watching! Hi everyone, it's Chloe from Wondershare Filmora here to empower your inner video creator. It's October again, which means Halloween is coming. Are you ready to make some spooky Halloween videos this year? How about a creepy lyric video like this? This effect can be easily done using chroma key in Filmora 10. Let me show you how to do it. First, let's start with filming the video clips we need. Take a piece of green paper and dark color marker. You can get these supplies at your local craft or office supply store. Choose the song you're going to use as the music for this video, then find the lyrics. We're going to film the written lyrics on the paper line by line later. Now let's write the lyrics on the green paper. Make sure the letters are big enough they can be seen clearly in the video footage when editing. I'm going to leave enough space between each line on the paper so it's easier to separate and move from line to line later when filming. If the lyrics you're using are long, feel free to use multiple pieces of paper. Okay, the lyrics are done and let's film them. We suggest playing the music at the same time when filming, so we can go from lyric to lyric, timing the movement of the camera with the music. Review your footage to make sure you are getting a clear shot of the lyrics. It might take a few tries to have the movement as accurate and on time as we can, but this will make the editing easier. Let's see how the clip looks with the music. Okay, now that we have the lyric video, let's film some really spooky background video that we will layer under the lyrics. You can also use spooky stock footage videos. Just make sure you have the license to use them. When the lyric video and the background video are ready, let's bring them into Filmora 10. Drag and drop the spooky background video to the first video track on the timeline. Adjust the sequence of clips as needed. Then drag and drop the lyric video onto the second video track. Since we have recorded the music, we will have audio in this video. We don't need the audio in the clips, so we can delete it, right click to detach the audio from the video, delete the audio clip. Make sure the background clip is aligned with the lyric video at the end. Feel free to speed up or slow down any video clips to match the end of two video tracks. Now let's key the green paper out from the lyric video. Double click the lyric video on the timeline. Go to the top left video settings and find the chroma key section. Check the box to activate the chroma key effect. The green color should be keyed out now. If there are spots that are not being keyed out, click on the eyedropper tool here to select the color of the green paper and key the green color out one more time. The settings in the chroma key section can also be helpful if you want to enhance the green screen effect. Try using the offset and tolerance slider to clean up the text. You can always adjust the scale, rotation, and opacity of the videos by double-clicking on them and change the settings in the transform section. When all the videos are ready, let's drag and drop the music onto the audio track and sync the video with the audio. If we have recorded the music in real time, the sync should be good already. You can also add more effects to make your video extra spooky. Feel free to add sound effects or even layer some filters or overlays. You can check out more effects at filmstock.thewarnershare.com. The sound effects we used in this video can be found in Filmstock standard subscription. All right, let's check out the result. This effect works on almost any kind of lyric videos, so it doesn't have to be spooky. Play around with it and see what you can create with it. Are you going to use this effect in your Halloween video this year? Let us know in the comments! Don't forget to like and subscribe for more new videos on the channel. Keep creating and see you next time!